What kind of retailer had like a Black Friday sale out on the street? And I'm like, hey, look at them doing Black Friday. It's not really a thing though. Is DisplayPort better than HDMI? Probably, because HDMI is horrible. Being better than HDMI is not saying a lot. It's not saying a lot. The big stores have a sale? Okay. Maybe he got some sick deals on USB-C cables. I, I, every time I say that, I feel like I have to specify. USB-C to USB-C for power delivery charging. But when I finish here and, and leave, like, um, the stores will have opened again. They reopen at 5. I got here a little early. And the Thunderbolt and the Slayport over a USB-C cable. You can't? Do you need, like, an adapter? But I probably actually will do, I will check out to see if there's any deals when I finish the stream today. I mostly want to get a new phone for chat and navigation because the OnePlus 6 that I use has a super dim screen and I, it, I cannot read it when it's in full sunlight. Smartphone cover shop or grocery store. They're everywhere. And maybe. It's just like, I don't want to go into really big places and leave my bike out on the street. Because it's a city. So it might be something better to do, like, once I wind down the stream. But we'll see. Namidia with the eight month prime. Thank you for the eight months. I appreciate it. Yeah, I'm looking for a phone that just, like, cranks out the brightness. Bunch of t-shirts. A Pikachu ornament from GameStop for under 50 bucks, okay. And a Christmas tree from Target for 34, nice. Yeah, I bought a Christmas tree about yay tall. Me and Sarah did last year for, I think it was like five bucks. So that's a Christmas tree. I'm gonna put our presents under it. The Christmas tree might be hidden by the presents, but technically the tree is there. Get a small tablet instead? I was thinking about that. If there was a good small tablet, but like we're looking like at one of the eight inch, max nine inch tablets. Like anything bigger than that is just like crazy. There was a, a good deal on like a premium tablet. I don't think I need a premium tablet. It's like the Samsung S7 Plus tab. And I'm like, oh, you know, that's a big discount. And everyone's like, oh, it's a really good deal. I'm like, okay. It's like, I follow like a deal form in Canada. And I looked at it and it was 12.4 inches. And I'm like, nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Imagine that thing strapped onto the, the handlebar bag of my bike. That's what's that? That's, that's, that's nine inches there, there. So like, it's like that from corner to corner. It's huge. <laughs> I'd need a, a tablet holder thingy, majigger, if I was gonna do tablet stuff. Uh, great catch up again, uh, as I do most days. I know you're uh, super fit, but I'm surprised you drink alcohol. 
Do you feel the slightest bit tired or dehydrated by drinking it? Not dehydrated, but I, I think if I have a drink, I'm not really affected by it that much. If I do a night of drinking, then yeah, I feel very sluggish the next day. Um, I don't know. Is, would it be better to not have any? Probably. I don't know how much it affects performance. It, it's quite common in like the... I feel like in the cycling and a lot of endurance athletes at the end of their day of endurance athleting they drink but maybe that's a bad idea maybe they should stop doing that oh ouch nice beard when puberty hits that thing's gonna come in real nice oh my soul <laughs> Alright, I'll take that. <laughs> Ouch. Here's a bunch of calories that you need. Yeah, there you go, that's the spirit. That's the spirit. Yeah, beer is fairly calorific. So, body just wants a whole bunch of energy, and beer has energy in it. Always had a good sense of humor. You have to be able to take a little bit of insults every now and then. Nobody's perfect, including me. This is when you're supposed to insult my cycling hair after a day of cycling. Ooh, it's coming up to a real nice peak right in the middle of my head right now. That's premium. Where's Sarah? She'd be so happy with me right now. A recent phone review jsamarino.com they tested brightness levels of many phones maybe I w maybe I, I should do that I wonder if you can narrow it down you can go to like spreadsheets because some of those review websites are actually really good